a journey of home renovation and maintenance. Welcome to Maintaining 18. The first wheelbarrow Kofi bought was a dual wheel poly wheelbarrow. It was a great wheelbarrow, but its weakness showed up unexpectedly. It was great because it made work much more manageable. And for example, the juniors were able to carry six cubic feet of wood. It did not last the winter. The effect of sub-zero temperatures caused the poly tray to become brittle. The tray shattered during light use. It was under warranty and Kofi received a full refund. It took some months to get a replacement. Kofi was particular that the wheelbarrow is steel and features dual wheels. Dual wheels are a significant upgrade. The new wheelbarrow performed as expected. Not wanting to repeat the purchase of another wheelbarrow, Kofi thought it best to protect it. Steel trays are durable but have their set of issues and less severe. The purpose of the wheelbarrow reminded him of the bed of a pickup truck. Some years ago, Kofi remembered seeing a spray-on bed liner. You know what he's thinking. The wheelbarrow is a year old and used to transport mortar, cement, rocks, mulch and dirt. It spends most of his life outside uncovered. It was used to mix cement at one point. It has seen some heavy action. Not long ago, after being in service, the blue paint began to flee. That was in part due to a pressure washer and in part due to tossing stones into the tray. The weather cycle is also a factor. If this keeps up, the wheelbarrow will have to be replaced prematurely and it was challenging to come by. So what is Kofi to do? Protect the life of the wheelbarrow. A spray-on bed liner will be applied. But first, continuing with the preparation. The cement vestiges have to be removed. The wheelbarrow was used to raise the garage floor. The cement vestiges is removed using a hand scraper. The rust has to be removed. There are chemical rust removers that were not used. A grinder with a flap disc probably would remove the rust a lot better. Kofi is satisfied with sanding and having some rust remain. There were some troubled spots. The tub is connected to the handle using some bolts. Those bolts had rust on them. They are also curved. Sanding those bolts was not easy and there was some rust remaining on the bolts. In all, it took about four minutes to sand the tub. There is something to note. This project had to be completed during the lunch hour. To prepare the spray on bed liner took about five minutes of shaking. This is the 15 ounce can of Rust-Oleum truck bed coating. Before purchase, the promotional information from Rust-Oleum states, Rust-Oleum truck bed coating as a barrier from rust and abrasion provides a durable, non-skid finish that protects both metal and painted surfaces. It covers 20 square feet. It takes one to two minutes between coats and dries matte black in 60 minutes. The truck bed coating stops rust, so the bolts that had rust on them should not further deteriorate. Good to know Kofi is covered there. Kofi will not win any awards. The product was running, and the initial outcome was not the best Kofi had done. The product comes out of the can fast and thick. Pausing for a second and there will be a river. To avoid running, allow two minutes before spraying on a second coat. Here, Kofi did not pause between coats. There are other options, such as a wheel barrow liner insert. Kofi's unsolicited opinion, 
save these for battery powered wheelbarrows that cost enough to justify having your wheelbarrow rock the equivalent of a Gucci bag. There are some vestiges of the label. The label was not removed during sanding. Nevertheless, the application of the bed liner seemed to have lift some areas. The intention was to use two cans and although this is a wheelbarrow, the finish matters. A little light sanding removed the high areas. The second coat hid those imperfections. Before a second application of the truck bed coating, the juniors got a hold of the wheelbarrow and took it on a little spin. A damp rag was used to remove the dirt and the second coat applied. Kofi wants the steel wheelbarrow to last, hopefully you do as well. Steel wheelbarrows will last a very, very long time. Nevertheless, they're made differently today than they were in the past. Protect your wheelbarrow. Apply a bit coating. Ideally, this level of protection is much easier with a brand new wheelbarrow. Nevertheless, Older wheelbarrows, as you just saw, can also be protected. The wheelbarrow will be put through the paces come summer. Stay tuned to see how it performs. A special thanks to subscribers of Maintaining 18. The channel is about home renovation and maintenance. If you haven't done so, please consider subscribing. Thanks for checking out Maintaining 18. That is all Kofi has for you today. The day is one.